everybody. I am C.J. Miller. I live in Shreveport, Louisiana, across the Red River from beautiful Bossier City, Louisiana. And uh, <laughs> here I am at my apartment. And here you'll see uh, an LED reflecting on my uh, balcony door. Then there's uh, <laughs> my uh, Tesla ball glowing in my window, and then I've got a pair of LED lights uh, in the living room window, and I have them on so I can check them out. So I, I love LED lights, and I put a bulb in the old apartment. When I moved here, I put one, uh, or I put uh, some bulbs in the, in the lamps so they would shine, and then... Uh, other people uh, started doing it, putting lights, you know, stylish LED lights in their windows. And every once in a while, I see that. But secretly, yo, secretly, I am uh, competitive. <laughs> uh, not not like not like in a good spirited kind of way, <laughs> but like in a Clark Griswold. Uh, Christmas vacation kind of way <laughs> but also we have certain limitations about what we're able to do <laughs> in our apartments but here we go so this is where the where the colored lights are that's my windows there and then of course this here where there's no light on that's also that's my bedroom window but yay I'm so excited Oh, cool. Let me back it up. I've got more LED light bulbs that are programmable. I love these things. But I need to go inside. I've had my health walk for the evening. I've had my philosophy. My philosophy is about, uh, you know, some people who incidentally inspired me. Like, they weren't trying to... Uh, make any sort of testament with what they did uh my good friend who is a just has a you know if he's not a perfect person he has uh, a, a beautiful character and a beautiful soul you know and uh you know uh gets a lot of things done and then uh so he's an inspiration to me and then because it doesn't make sense you know you would think you guys are so different why would you be friends but oh my god do we have the same <laughs> uh, <laughs> very bad sense of humor and uh, I'll tell you we're both wicked smart you know but anyway uh, uh, I can say that with confidence I, I, I feel that I'm pretty intelligent uh, and so the uh, the other guy uh, that I subletted from um, you know, to watch him uh, uh, create a business, basically. Uh, and not because he was, uh, you know, granted any sort of, like, you know, like he, he, he built that business uh, hammer and nails, you know. Uh, uh, sander, grinder, that kind of thing. Like, yeah, that's cool. So, mad respect for that guy. And uh, there, my life is full of people like that who uh, let positivity bring happiness and get them through uh, tougher times. And those examples do good for me. So, and from there, I, I went on to talk about, uh, oh, you know that park that I walked through uh, when I moved downtown? That was just the empty cement. And then they, uh, you know, old from old buildings that were there and that they cleared out or whatever. But they uh, made something beautiful of it. And this whole area used to be nothing but, nothing but hollowed out, you know, stripped of everything. All the copper wiring, all of it just gone, just empty shells. Of, of homes and then the, the 
you know, uh, they cleared that for the studio. So it would be like, hey, let's, you know, back in 2005, let's uh, let, let the studio come here. We'll clear it away. Wanted to really entice the studios or whatever. So that's kind of cool. They were, I guess they're like, they were not working. Like, it was bad. <laughs> I'm like, we're not making movies next to this crap, <laughs> you know, whatever. I don't know. But, you know, it turned out to be a good thing, you know. And so, uh, what else? Um, oh, um, from there, um, and I'm talking quietly. There are people who live here. Let me kind of walk over to the... Uh, there's a little bench over here. I'll walk over and sit. Nah, I'll just wrap it up. Uh, it turned out to be a good thing. Hang on, let me get upstairs. Uh, so there's a... Uh, of these lights. <laughs> and, uh, aha. And, aha. Uh, I forget that, that when I'm talking and I gotta, like, uh, catch my thought or something that I can pause this... Uh, video so it was like for a moment I was gonna wander around the parking lot and then if anybody noticed me it was like wouldn't that look weird so let me pause it and come inside but you know just for I don't know just for looking at lights or whatever while we finish this off uh, I took the walk made a little video rambled talked and uh, found what I wanted to share which was um, renewal of gratitude and, uh, and uh, the lessons of patience while I waited for this apartment. Uh, and I didn't get it until uh, almost two years ago. It'll be two years at the end of September that I've been here. And just to remain uh, grateful and humble about that and then how to... Um, hopefully, you know, be of a, be of a positive, uh, if not an influence, then at least some sort of, uh, have an example of a, of a positive attitude that people can check out with it. If nothing else, let me at least be the be the model of a nice person a pleasant person a, a nice attitude and that is just like any other uh thing sometimes it has to be uh worked out like a muscle uh like any other behavior trait you know uh being nice can it's easy sometimes and then sometimes when you feel cranky or irritable or whatever then uh then maybe it could be more challenging and uh, the exercise comes in knowing when to relax and not succumb to stress over what really is ultimately unimportant. Love and light, everybody. Peace. Bye.